Hey, what's going on you guys? One half of the Streets of Rage Quid duo here with your boy Lee Casey, also known as Wonder Havoc on various social media handles. We're going to talk about Animal Crossing New Horizon on this particular episode. And you're probably scratching your head and asking yourself, why are we talking about Animal Crossing New Horizon? We haven't heard any updates. We haven't heard anything for the summer. They haven't dropped any information. That's exactly why we need to talk about this. A number of people online f seem to think that Animal Crossing New Horizons has been forgotten in the eyes of Nintendo. This couldn't be further from the truth. We have the recent Cyrus wedding event from June 1st ending on the 30th. We might be a day or two away from a potential trailer announcement for all of the summer DLC to happen in 2021. So if we're due for an update in Animal Crossing New Horizons, the summer content that we cannot wait to get our hands on, friggin' splash right into, all pun intended, what are some things that you want to see? I'll tell you some things that I want to see, whether it's been proven via data mine and we're just sitting on it waiting for it, or otherwise. I would love to see the return of an ordinance system to keep ourselves cool in the summertime. How awesome would it be if you could walk up to resident services and throw down the ordinance of having maybe winter all year round? Maybe an ordinance where you could clean up the weeds when you take a couple of weeks off. Maybe you get busy. Maybe you gotta go to work and you just have no time to play that ACNH, baby. Right from the moment you decide to play Animal Crossing New Horizons again, those ordinances will take care of all of your needs just so you don't have to worry about the cleanup and the upkeep while you're busy. I think that'd be super cool to have ordinance come back in some fashion or another. I think another really cool thing that we haven't seen yet, which I'm very surprised about, is the fact that you can schedule a hangout session with a particular villager. I believe that this was found in a data mine, spoiler alert, but this was a really cool feature from games of memories past, like Animal Crossing New Leaf on the 3DS, where you could hang out with a villager at a specified time, they would come over to your house, they would comment on your furniture. I think it'd be really cool to bring that back for a particular summer update. You know, just, you know, strengthen the bonds between you and your villagers a little bit. Give us a hug mechanic. Allow me to hug Stitches and Anka with their consent, of course. How cute would that be? There's so many things that they could do with the summer update. Obviously, you're going to get new items, you're going to get new clothing, you're going to get new things to put around your island. That is a given. Maybe they'll do stuff with uh, Pascal again. Maybe they will give us an additional smaller island. Maybe you can add a brand new villager to that smaller island. What if over on the dock every couple of days, Cap'n will visit and you could, you could venture out from that boat to a smaller section? You would be able to benefit from having a smaller portion, you know, designated to uh, a little locale that you can visit with Cap'n. You know, have him hum that tune, friggin' boat you all the way down to a smaller island. You can place other things. It'd be good for storage. Obviously, we had the storage upgrade a couple of months ago. It was very beneficial to a lot of Animal Crossing New Horizon players. But as big as your imagination is, you're limited in the size of your island. The island is pretty big. The island that we have right now is pretty graciously big, but sometimes we run out of space. Sometimes we need additional space for these overflowing imaginative ideas. It would make a lot of sense to place said ideas in a little smaller section, but that smaller section might not be even attached to this particular island. You might have to boat there with your good boy Cap'n in a future update. I guess the underlying message to this particular video is, you gotta be patient. You gotta be patient with what Nintendo is presenting us. A lot of people think that, you know, just because you haven't heard anything in a few months means they're just working on absolutely nothing. Could be further from the truth. Whenever Nintendo is quiet, they've got a lot up their sleeves. How could you not? Game sold over 30 million copies. It still has a large player base. I still play this game on a friggin' daily basis. Uh, so many of my friends are continuously playing, looking for ways to be inspired through Animal Crossing New Horizons. They're not giving up on this game anytime soon. We are due for a summer update, which begs the question, what kind of stuff do you wanna see in a summer update? When they decide to drop this announcement trailer, what do you anticipate for summer 2021 updated Animal Crossing New Horizons? Let us know in the comments section down below just because we're the ones giving you this information doesn't make our view set or our stance on video games any more important than what you guys have to say. As a matter of fact, you guys keep the discussion rolling on the streets of Rage Queen. We love hearing from you. All of the comments that you post for us, we read them. We love them. We want to thank you guys for engaging in this conversation with your boy Lee Casey and sometimes Jesse Bloomhagen whenever he's able to make it on the streets. Of course, we got to hand it to our player too sometimes, but... 
Seriously, you guys are the ones keeping this hype train rolling right through. It only makes sense to me that we are mere moments away from having an announcement trailer for Animal Crossing New Horizons 2021 Summer DLC, and you can safely bet when that trailer drops, your boy is going to be reacting to it because I am very excited about what's to come for the future of Animal Crossing New Horizons. I'm a big AC fan. I have always been a fan of Animal Crossing, you know, right from the inception on Nintendo GameCube when we first got it on North American soil for that very first time. Ooh boy, haven't stopped playing Animal Crossing since. A wee young lad in junior high. And I have no intention of stopping anytime soon. All right, guys, enough of me blabbing. This conductor is going to send you off with a farewell. I want to thank you so much for tuning into this video. Feel free to share with a friend, family member, a like-minded individual, a fan of Animal Crossing New Horizons if you enjoyed what you saw. Feel free to engage us on discussion. We'd love to hear what you want from Summer 2021's DLC. We will see you for the next upcoming video. And don't forget to stay hydrated if you're going outside uh, in this friggin' hot summer weather. I don't know about you guys, but over here in Canada, we're in the middle of a heat wave right now. It's 39 degrees Celsius. And when I say Celsius, I'm talking like 100 plus Fahrenheit for people over in America. I think that's the, I think that's the, that's the correct comparison. That's the equivalence, if you will. Anyway. If you are playing AC, make sure you're blasting some of that AC, that air conditioning, while you're doing so. Take care of yourself and each other. Stay hydrated. We'll see you for the next video, and uh, we'll see you. We'll see you around. I'll see